Welcome to My Long Island TV. From Manhasset to Montauk, we have traveled our communities to bring you the following events. I'm your host, Waldo Cabrera. My Long Island TV starts now. Welcome to the Nassau County Museum of Art. We are on the second floor, and three galleries on this floor contain beautiful paintings of the artist Louis Comfort Tiffany as part of our Tiffany's Orient exhibition. This amazing collection of paintings has been gifted to the museum. He had his life in New York City. His father's company, Tiffany and Company, was in Manhattan, but he was very connected to Long Island as well. He had built this incredible structure, this architectural feat in called Laurelton Hall in 1908. So behind me, I think, is one of the really lovely examples of some of the landscape works that Tiffany painted in the late 1800s. It's actually titled A View of Cairo and it's very detailed architecturally and Tiffany did not necessarily do plein air painting. He did not paint outside, he actually used photography. So he was able to capture some of the architectural features and they are very accurate in the sense that you are looking at some of the minarets and some of the cityscapes that are kind of set into this, again, landscape. Here you have the Temple of Ramses. We see this very dramatic light cast onto the figures, onto the very rocky textural surface of the temple. And I think it's just such a great example of what he was very interested in, in capturing light. We think that as he went further into his interest in stained glass was um, somewhat a frustration that he needed to capture more light. So we see his attempts at doing that and we think, I think this is a very successful example of that. Tiffany gives us an example of a seascape. He's able to kind of really show off some of his abilities. This very beautiful, almost still, but kind of moving very gracefully and gently um, in the water. This lovely blue sky capturing just with a couple of strokes of paint. These paintings could actually capture these kind of quaint scenes that uh, Tiffany would witness during his travels to North Africa. Um, and here, I think he gets to show off some of his um, ability to capture light, both on architectural features, on people, and on some of the animals um, that the people in the villages would use as workhorses. What's very important is that these features became imprinted as and part of him um, coming back to the United States and in some of his windows and some of his interior design, he actually utilized some of these beautiful kind of Moorish arches that you get to see through the landscape. Tiffany's Orient exhibition is on view here at the museum through November 9th. For more information, you can go to the museum's website, which is www.nassaumuseum.org.